What's up drivers? Welcome to 6 Minute Saturdays. I'm your host Dash Campbell. Today we're starting us off with a donkey. You f***ing donkey! The whole reason I started this series wasn't just so I could get away with using some absolutely mental clips that I find on Reddit under the fair use and commentary blah blah blah. It was so that I could discuss in greater detail some of the more bizarre dashcam clips that I capture myself. And today we have quite the strange one. Recently I spotted this group of gentlemen, <clears throat> I use that term lightly, who I swear to god seem like they were on some kind of post-gym cocaine fueled steroid rage bender in the middle of town. Firstly one of the group breaks away to have a piss in a doorway which gently trickles down into the street for everyone to stand in. He then pretty much bodies this poor lass out the way who's just stood there kissing her boyfriend to try and catch up to his mates. Who are all being very loud, very animated, shouting, swearing. Just generally being quite a nuisance. You know, there's just pure testosterone flying everywhere. But then out of nowhere, Pissy Pants comes up and... Yeah, I don't know either. They all disappear for a little bit, but they eventually return to have a nice wholesome match of Street Fighter. Round one, fight! fight. But it's alright, love and hugs make everything better. But for the piss, and that random moment of bike destruction, that earns you a donkey award my friend. Now recently I've spotted this motorcyclist wearing a variety of pop culture helmets. Some classics include the Kermit, the Clown, the Monkey, and the Policeman. I also spotted a bloke doing the bins at Mackey's in a Viking helmet. Keep wearing funky things in public, people. Because it makes our days spotting it. Anyway, it is time for The Road Rules. Yes, it does. Nice to see you. Yes, it is. <laughs> this is where we'll take a look at some of the best and worst of the miscellaneous driving clips that I have stumbled upon during my internet browsing. First up is probably my favourite magic trick of all time. Hocus pocus, there's pizza on your focus. <laughs> Bullseye. <laughs> America is still being, well, oh, shit. America. Now this clip is, I'm guessing, the reason why a lot of fuel pumps are detachable. And once again, I'm guessing that this is in America, and I think you guys can just kind of leave your hose to it, can't you? Like, you can just put it in and let it do its job, whereas we actually have to stand there and manually hold it until our car is full. But the fact we've got to do that definitely helps you remember not to leave it in and drive off with it. <laughs> no one ever suspects the trolley. I'd maybe sympathise a little bit more with her if she wasn't diagonally parked across two bays. This absolute psychopath crashes his car at high speed after misjudging a gap and then sits there whistling eye of the tiger. At least he could maybe claim insanity at court. In Plymouth, there's this cat that loves getting on the bus. It just walks onto the bus, helps itself to a seat, and the drivers are always really accommodating of it and they always make sure it gets home safe. On at Pool Park Road bus stop near his home in St Budo. His 11 mile journey takes him past HMS Drake to the centre of Plymouth and back again. 
I gotta give it to him though, the little guy, what a champ. Like, my days, man, he's gotta have shattered at least four ribs. He just collects himself, gets his bike, and does the walk of shame. Top marks, my dude, you've earned your man card. But anyway, that's all we have time for today. If you like this video, give it a like, give me a sub, join my Patreon, and check out the affiliate links in the description. And we'll have another chinwag really soon. Peace! That is a high